Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a day or so ago, I posted that if you are using Microsoft's Copilot for Windows 11 on the desktop, that it received these new suggestions, which uh, is a new section that basically offers suggestions to help you get started using Copilot. And also an up and coming feature is that the actual Copilot window um, is getting a lot wider. For more space to chat so this is currently how it is and it's eventually going to get a little bit wider on the desktop and um, for more space to chat while keeping other windows the same size now i'll leave that video down below if you'd like more info but just to point out one or two more little small little copilot changes uh, in case you're interested and are using copilot maybe on a day-to-day -day basis now the first is that we can see here now that at the top there's an opening edge They've added a new button in the toolbar, opening edge. So uh, if you are using Copilot and want to kind of cut to the chase and get to Microsoft Edge and head straight online, where you can use Copilot online, then that may be a nice move in the right direction. We're just clicking on that toggle as mentioned. Um, basically, closes Copilot on your desktop and then opens up Copilot in Microsoft Edge. And I think if you, this is something you are using, on a day-to-day -day regular basis then this may be a nice move as would say in the right direction and then a small little change i just want to bring to attention in case you hadn't noticed but i had noticed this maybe two to three days ago you may have seen it you may have not but the bing icon that was here to the top right of the search has now also been replaced by ask copilot and when you click on that the same thing happens it opens up copilot in the Microsoft Edge web browser. So um, this is Microsoft's start now to integrate Copilot, as I've been mentioning, in future versions of Windows, more into the actual shell, the daily operation and function of Windows. And already we can see now that even with these two little small changes, that um, that is also now starting to happen where they've just integrated that a little bit more into the actual OS. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.